invented flu powder. Lesson, we will cover a truly thrilling event. The Goblin Rebellion of 1752 and all its triumphant tragedy. But more specifically, uh, we will address the devastating effects it had on the wizard milling industry. Throughout the many goblin battles, countless wizard cloaks were lost. Actually, we do know the number. 632. But history occurs outside the classroom. And look, it's time for my constitutional. One can practically osmose the history flowing through Hogwarts. I think the professor wants us to follow him. Now for a stroll to the Bell Tower Entrance Hall. Along with the rest of the castle, it was completed in the late early Middle Ages. The hall and the bell towers that loom above it contain myriad interesting artifacts. Good to see you. I, uh... Are you? No doubt you're... Not all goblins are... Did you say Brackball? Hmm... Uh, where were we? Back to our class topic for... T <sighs> Searching for Grimbald Weft is so dark. Rebellion! Oh, yes. I see you found Grimbo. Why didn't you tell us it was just his skull? Now, let's turn up. He's also nearby. Standing in eternal but symbolic watch over the bell tower is a Sir retinue Afton, of this loyal This is a knights. centuries old likeness of Pandagora. Revelio. Statues of Earth Puddle of the cheerful countenance nestled among the ranks. Professor Bins, I found the statue of Sir Athapuddle. Ah, well done. So beloved was he. Of course, that did not bode well. Goblins and wizard kind will never trust each other. Yeah, hmm, his... the wise student... 